Hey gang, welcome back to the Spring Update series we're playing. This is our vanilla playthrough series of all the new Spring Updates uh, on our map. And if you're after something a little bit more heavily modded and uh, decoration and all that sort of stuff, then head on over to the Lonely Pines uh, series we've got going on at the moment. Check that out. There is a Season 1 uh, if you want to catch up with that. And now we're into Season 2 on that as well. But uh, we're continuing on from last time out. We established our freight line here. You can see it uh, over here at Bah. Bah, button up a humper, humber, ham, humber, don't, don't, okay, yeah, sorry, Dad. Uh, we're going from here, dropping off here at Cleethorpes, and we've also got uh, outside of Tick Hill um, hooked up as well, which affords us a great connection that's going to net us a handy and hefty profit, uh, I'm thinking, because we're going to be taking goods from here, sending them all the way down the line to here to drop off at Tick. And then we're actually going to be sending food back on the same train all the way back down. Uh, no, we're going to be sending food to here, sorry. Uh, in for Cleethorpes. Okay, what guy? What do these guys want? They want combats and machine parts. We're making combats here. Do you guys want combats? No. But I'm pretty sure they do. And somehow we might be able to connect a train that might be able to. So we might be able to drop the combats off here as well. And then do another connecting train up. Or just do a long hauler from down here which might really ramp up this which means we can put our stone production back in with these guys what else have we got down here that we can utilize well we can send this crew this uh, crude oil well here up to get refined we can bring it back and then we can send it over here to produce fuel and we can send fuel into tick hill uh, it can go to little Little Hampton as well. And who else needs fuel? That's it for this end of the map. We haven't even got to the other side of the map yet. So you can see even just with smaller... Ah, so uh, is this a medium map? I think we're on a medium map. You can even see with medium-sized maps these days with the new updates just how much the gameplay can make this... What am I saying here? What I'm trying to say is how much it increases the lifespan of a map is basically what I'm saying. All right, anyway, enough talk, enough chit-chat. Let's get into the episode. All right, we're set outside of Barton Upper Humber. And uh, what are we doing? Well, we're going to set up our first line, which is going to be goods. To the uh to the train station over here now i actually want to just check the town because we've been doing a little bit of uh uh what i want to call uh rejigging the town a little bit making sure that we don't have certain products uh bring this up for me instead this one here we we want to kind of filter out and make residential over this side and then keep all the industrial and commercial mostly over this side so things like this you guys aren't going to be living in and around here. Sorry to disappoint you. This is down. This is the downtown area, guys. I don't mind the mix maybe starting from like these blocks. So we can have mix in here. But when it comes to these blocks in here, this is purely designed for commercial downtown area. Same with you guys. We're not having homes out where the uh, industrial zone is, okay? I know you guys might think it's cheap land. But it's not happening. You can stay there and you can just see they've started like re rejigging and oh yep, yeah, more space for me to build. Okay. Right. The next thing we're gonna do is because because our goods line comes from here and our train stations here, which is kind of a little bit detrimental to our noise pollution. You can see right here where it comes in. So these these are the only guys that get affected. We actually have to send a truck line down to the down to the actual uh, depot. We might just do a little bypass road here just to skip the side of town. Uh, even though I think the AI will grow out this way, you know, if that's their choice in the end, that's their choice in the end. But I think for the now, we might just give them a bit of a bypass road. So we'll actually we'll go something like uh, we might even bring a roundabout in town. Do I have the ability to make roundabouts yet? Tools, waypoints, buildings, streets. No, we don't. Okay, we don't have that yet. We're not we're not late enough into the period. Uh, let's go to half speed, thanks. Okay, well, if that's the case, let's get a little pull-off road there. Uh, I don't mind having sort of angled roads sometimes. And you can continue like this. And go like that. Yep. 
Uh, do you want to put one here? I think that's not... That's not a bad option. We could just make it a little tiddler street. Okay, sorry about your house. Sorry, not sorry. Let's also just go and give these guys... We got a bit... We got plenty of cash in the bank now. We're doing pretty well in this series. Uh, let's live... Let's give you a bit of strength. Give you a bit of this. Let's get you... Uh, maybe just use that. I'm used to having on uh, the Lonely Pine series... Uh, uh, I've got a modded brush set so I can get bigger... Bigger brushes. Okay, just get this all nice and flat. So the AI has got flat building. Otherwise you end up with Chungus... Chungus building going on. Look at that, the AI has already taken... Uh, taken its own accord. And it's going to shoot a street straight across there. I might just finish that for them. Uh, you know what, we might do a bit of the old... City Skylines esque building where we put in our own sort of streets. Uh, oh, he put a nice little curve on there. I kind of would like you to marry up there. We're going to do that. And what about there? Yeah, make it interesting. Okay, really get their traffic issues. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> more intersections, more traffic. Uh, what do you want to do here? Sure. Sure. Do you want one there as well? Yeah, why not? Okay. That's uh, that's going to be uh, residential. They can sort something out over here for themselves. This is going to allow us to put a line in here. Now, I could probably upgrade this to a bigger road, and I think we might actually, straight off the bat, just to save a bit of a headache later if this is going to be a main street. I don't know how the AI will, will take take to this, but at least this, it affords us a bigger road through here uh, for our vehicles that are going to come through. Right, so we want a new line. We're going from here to here. Okay, lovely. I'm glad that you took that path. The path of least resistance. Thank you. Now, uh, we are goods. I'm going to go with the, like a sort of army colored, like a greeny, beigey, browny color. Uh, so we go down here and we'll, we'll, we'll pick this, uh, we'll pick this one. Shift, click. Uh, let's get like a sort of, uh, uh, that's a bit too green. We'll go like, what products are green actually on the map? Probably nothing. So I think let's make goods green for the moment. We'll just make them green. Okay. Fair enough. Goods. Uh, this is a delivery. Uh, naming convention is different to how I have it on Lonely Pines, so I have to really think about this. And this is B. B. Delivery. So we'll just put TRNF because it's transfer. Uh, and this is truck. B. I want to put uh, depot. B. Depot transfer. And buy truck. There we go. That seems better. All right, lovely. Uh, we don't need to give you two drop-offs there. What about your pickup? Which one are you picking up from over here? Perfect. Oh, I like purple and green together. It's kind of like the Joker colors. Okay, so that's established. Let's get the line from the other end because we're going to have the delivery going into Tick Hill. Um, from... Oh, look, I've got truck stops everywhere. We're going to go from this one. Same thing. We could actually probably... I wish there was a copy button. Uh, that's probably one thing that we can add, is to be able to copy this this uh, line, uh, or this... Um, I suppose you can. I just click on that and hit Control c but I don't know. Just like right-click, copy, paste, and then edit the line. It's... that's just nitpicking now. Now, we've got a, we've got a truck stop in town here. I wonder if it's time we afford Tick Hill with a proper drop-off. Let's have a look at where... Oh, we've got one here. Right. Right. And if that's the case, we would be dropping to... Uh, what are we dropping? Goods. Goods are over this side of town. Ay ay ay. Right smack bang in the middle. Do we need to do some, um, some vetting in Tick Hill and get these guys growing a certain way? Ooh, yeah. Ooh, okay. I'm more inclined to leave. I wonder if we should move some of these buildings so they grow over here a little bit more and move the residential ones. Yes. Let's let's do that. Let's give it a go, hey, for science. 
Uh, you could have left those there, actually. Let's get rid of some of these. Cost is going to be expensive, but if we move some of these guys out of the zone, maybe we let them stay around this side, and then we can let the residential grow here. Uh, industrial, I want to get you guys out of this way. I don't want to force the industrial down around this way a little bit further. Are you guys really going to build over here? I don't think so. We want to push, we want to push you guys further over this way, and push you guys further down this way. As much as it's nice having some of these buildings along there. Ah, uh, oh, actually, I should have probably left. Look at these little little uh, industrial homes or uh, places hiding in there. You can leave there as well. Uh, no, I don't want you in there. I want this for residential. You can have from here down here. Okay. Is that how we're going? Yeah. Make sure you haven't deleted your goods buildings. No, we've still got some. Right, so let's put a truck stop then in over this way of side of town. Where would you like to put that? Well, maybe we could make it down here and give us a reason to have something down here below the actual um, bridge. So it's a reason for things to start coming down. Uh, and what we can actually do, I wonder if we can get that truck stop situated under this bridge. That'd be really nice if we could. I don't know if we're going to be able to. Maybe you can have it like this. Uh, hmm, how would we go about that? Mm -hmm. What about if you spin it and then you edit it later? So have it like this. Also, you're making the road mush up. Can we go down, 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 down? No, we can't. Bugger, 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 bugger on toast. Sorry, sorry, so sorry. I'm going to level this ground a touch. I, I know what I want and I'm going to get it. Okay, level this down. Give us a little bit more height with our bridge. It is very low. It is a very low bridge. I'm just wondering if we put this here like such, can we get a road through there now? All signs point to yes. That's what I want. That's what I like about you. Okay, you can continue there. You can go there. And because we're getting um, footpathing connections all the way through there, it's going to help with connection to a lot of these buildings down around here. And maybe we can encourage the, the um, commercial to build down this way, industrial this corner, and then residential up here. That's the plan, the dreams, the hopes, anyway. So your connection is there. Let's see. Uh, let's see what you look like now. Do we have connection to any goods? Goods are really up here. Probably only just. Mm. Wonder if I can squeeze that maybe on. No, I wanna leave it here. We want to encourage these guys. Maybe I should knock a couple of these buildings out then. Get you guys building down this way. I know we lose a lot of our high-rise uh, zoning there, but you can have a mix in here. I don't mind that. You guys, however, are not there. What have I told you guys about that? Okay, and get out of there. Okay, it'll take a little bit of time for them to get back up into gear, but once we start getting goods in here, we might end up getting a bit of a uh, goods population building there. Right, now get the track in. Line, t uh, what's this line one? Line two. Hope I didn't just delete a line for no reason. Right, tick hill sightings, that's what we want. Add station, now down to here, okay. That's the way you're coming through town. Ha, huh, right through the residential zone. I think it's unavoidable. We could probably have them come this side and down and under. You know, that's not a bad option. 
Yeah, okay, that's not a bad option here. I hate that already. Something around the side of the mountain could be quite uh, tasteful. Right? Road and rail and mountains and... We can paint it and make it look half decent anyway at some point. Alright, so that will change the dynamics because we're about to do this now. Uh, line 2, manage the line, get rid of tick hill sidings and add... Yeah, that's better. And look at our truck line shift uh, from uh, this one here down around that way too. So we're, we're removing some lines straight out of the center of town and removing some of those emissions, which will uh, help our poor um, emission rate just a touch, okay? Uh, it just helps with growth and that sort of stuff. Right, okay, so that's established. Let's now give that a name. We'll probably, we'll color that green. And we'll give it the uh, goods. Uh, no, we don't need to do that actually. We need to go goods. And this is uh, ba. No, it's not. It's uh, tick. Tick depot. T R N F. And truck. Okay. So we've got the ends established. We've got the ends to a means established. Now, the big one. New line. We are going from here. All the merry way to here. Right? How are we looking double tracking wise? We haven't given you a... Oh, we have. Okay. We are also going to need to do this now. Bring me up that. See you down here. Signals. Right, we want to have you there. You're probably thinking, it's not working, Ham. It's not working. Uh, give it a chance, gang. Give it a chance. Also, you're going to be uh, that way. And that way. Yeah, because you can pause there. Okay, good. Uh, warning, abandoned industrial, indu industry. <gasps> oh, yeah, okay. We're going to have to get you guys. Uh, we'll put a little pause on for a second because I don't want to lose that. Where are we up to? Oh, somewhere around over here. All right, we've got that station. Or more. Okay. Uh, now the reason we don't have the ability to have it double tracked is because it has no way to get out of here, which we will fix that right now. Right. Look at that. Instantly fixed. That should be good and Gucci all the way along here now. Yep. Bloody marvelous. Okay. So that is train one. We might even bring you into this platform on this side. Do we have a diamond junction here? No, we don't. And you've put a lemon signal there, so that's not going to help. That's a big cross, by the way. I don't know if that's going to work that big. Oh, yep. Yeah. I was wrong. Uh, hmm. Manage the line, Ham. Let's bring you into bar on platform three and three quarters. <laughs> I've been really, I've been checking out the uh, Hogwarts Legacy gameplay a lot lately, uh, and I'm really, I'm really excited to play that game. Uh, so I've got Harry Potter on the mind, and I watched the new Fantastic Beast movie the other day. Love it, great. Uh, what do we want? One. Yep, that's better. That's what we want. Okay, 
first train off the ranks is on la number one. All right, let's give you a name and a color. Color is green, we're goods. Green is good. Okay, goods. And we are buh to tick. And we are by train. And that's all we need to write for that. Lovely, tell your mother. And now we've got a little depot train right here. Hopefully this works. You have the ability to come out and switch over to there. So that's perfect. Uh, let's establish our trucks first. Right, where's our truck? Oh, we blew up the truck stop. So we maybe put one down here somewhere. Uh, a new truck stop building. Truck stop. Unless I have one down here. Did I put... Unless I blew the one up down here as well. Okay, let's establish the truck stop with the actual train depot. Let's make it look like it's one and, one and the same. How do you want to do it? Somewhere in here would be nice. Just like this. Okay. Then what? Then what indeed? Then what indeed? Ooh, that's pretty simple. Uh, I know I'm using City Road, but hey, whatever. Okay, done. Buy some vehicles, cargo. Uh, goods, right, what takes goods? That takes all, that takes not goods. That takes all cargo. We'll go with these. We'll just put two on it at the moment. Uh, no, we won't. We'll put four. Set you guys on. Goods bah depot. Done. Look at us kicking goals. Then we'll do this one and then we'll buy the train. Uh, which one? Where's that depot? Oh, we're buying from here. Cargo, we'll do the same. We'll get two, three, four. Set you on goods. Tick. Done. All right. Um, before we buy the train and we hit play, let's just head over to this coal mine. Uh, or iron mine. Now, a couple of things. I could just send a truck down here to deliver these guys. Uh, and I think that's going to be the easiest way to save them at the moment. Just to, just to get them saved. Because I don't want to... Unless they're going to get moved to a closer spot, but I assume that we run the risk of them either A, moving to a closer spot, or B, moving to a further away spot, or C, never ceasing to exist ever again. C is probably an option, isn't it? Uh, I want buildings. I don't want just that. I want a truck stop. And you can just give me a one... It doesn't matter. We're making, we're making cash, money, money. All right, and do you have a truck stop down here? You do not. Okay. Now, configure. I didn't need to do this, but I am doing it. And putting a road. Voila. Okay, and let's also give you a little upgrade. Right, give me this line. Orange. Let's label you what? Ooh, iron. Yep. <laughs> yep. Iron hink. Hink. Um, and we're going to call this high iron hink. Well, it's east. So we could put east. Transfer. Docks. And then what we're putting, we're putting um, saved in. Yeah, we were. Saved industry. Okay. Let's buy these guys a truck, please. Where can we buy one of those from? There has to be a truck depot just here somewhere. Yep, there. Can you get around to there? Yes, you can. Buy one dump truck, please. Uh, do you have a better... Yeah, this one's better. Set you on 
iron saved industry hinkies. Perfect. Right, so he should be saved now. He should be saved now. <laughs> Come on. Where is it? Here he is here. Dun, 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 dun. Will he save that? Will he save the building by the time he gets there? Oh, this is live action, guys. This is like Channel 7 News coming to you live. We've got a truck chase going on down in the middle of downtown Hinkley. Will the truck make it to the iron mine in time? Who knows? Will it be saved? Who knows? He is making great efforts, though, speeding through the center of town. Come on, buddy, you can get there. Saved. We're saved. Must have to get within a certain range before it actually registers that it's saved, but either way, we've got iron being produced there, which means we're gonna have more iron on the docks, which means we need more ships. Uh, and I said that last time, manage vehicles, get them another ship, all right? All of a sudden, our little shipping lane up and down here is becoming a lot busier. Right. Uh, look, and we've got this iron mine here too. I'm thinking we're just going to truck some iron over here. We're just going to have iron coming from everywhere because we seem to be really struggling with our iron store. Um, so the more we can get produced there, the more steel we can get sent over here and vice and versa and knock on effect and so on. We're, that was what we were going to get to shortly after we set this train up is being able to ramp up these productions so we can ramp up this production because these guys currently don't have enough steel down here. Okay. We were going to get to that. I was going to get that to that with you guys, but, uh, look th like this is the spring update. It forces your hands sometimes to go and do something urgently. Okay, let's buy, let's go shopping. Now, we want something fair. Oh, actually, we haven't set up the last line that I want to set up first. Let's do that. Let us, let us tomato and cheese. Okay. Cleethorpes. We'll get, uh, we can go back to play now too. You don't have to go mental with that. Right. Buildings, trucks, food, right smack bang in the middle of town over here. So this is perfect for us. We actually might even just put a truck stop uh, in town here. What do we think? Uh, look, it's not the prettiest place to put it, but I'll be honest. It's what the people demand. Uh, and if we put it this way, here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thunking. We can actually go like this. Uh, no, configure. Give me a two-way. Do we want to put a little cargo building on it? Just to dress it up? Yeah, dress it up. I can't believe it allowed me to do that. I'll accept it. Uh, only because the game allowed it. All right, give me a little give me a little curvy one. Actually, I want some straight, I think. Oh, whoa, 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 why are you so... Oh, okay. I get it, I get it, I get it. If that's the case... No, Ham, I was going to think about tunneling under. Don't tunnel under. We might actually have to have this set up like this. Okay. Yeah, you're going to have to do that, buddy. Can we get a bit of smoothage going on around here? Is that a thing? Now, I am thinking about running the city over the top over here. Uh, why don't you do that now? Just put in some roads and see what happens. Yep, give me one up. Will that give me a bridge? That will. Okay. Lovely. Lovely tell your mother. Configure. Give me some platforms here. That are passenger. Because why not? Okay, and then you can, uh, you can actually just shoot off like that. Okay. 
just like so. Wonder if you could get one from here to here. I doubt it very much so. Yeah, yeah, you're dreaming, buddy. Uh, let's have you go to there. Let's have you swing up to there. All right, just like that. Okay, uh, you want to give them anything else? No, for the moment, I just want to leave it. We might run a, uh, we might run a road straight over that though, like a, like a crossing. Only if it doesn't affect my train track, which it doesn't. Okay, good level crossing. Okay, you probably could have come up in the end. That's better. Okay. Connections all around. Love it. Thank you, uh, game. Okay. Truck stop here. Truck stop there. Get the line in. This is our food line. So it's going to help Cleethorpes really take off a little bit more now. So we're going to go line details. Food. Uh, what are we? Uh, Clee. Clee uh, transfer. Uh, yep. Drop off. It's really delivery, isn't it? Yeah, but... Yeah. Okay, just leave it at that. Where's our vehicle joint? Just here. Let's get, um... Ooh, how many do you want on that? Hmm? Just give me two for the moment. Food, clear, truck transfer, and I've put a little uh, backslash on that <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> I'll fix that later. I'm not even worried about it. Okay, let's now, so now we've got that established. We Now we can buy our train. Oh, 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 here we go. I'm thinking something delicious, steamy, and friendly. What have we got here? This is too expensive to run already. Uh, plus not the right kind of train. What do you got this one? What's this one? 1.9 it costs Passenger what about the FD? Um, the 412 might be the way to go. Oh, it's a two squillion dollar train though uh, maintenance a year Probably not gonna have enough to to pay for that straight off the bat. Ah, uh, the Mikado was the first common freight. Here we go. First common freight locomotive. Does 80 though. I'd like it a little bit quicker, I've got to be honest. 120 for the Flying Scotsman, but we already used that as a passenger. These things are nightmares for maintenance. They do 100. Does 115. Maybe we should go this one here. Does 115, tractive effort of 104. Not that we're too worried because it's mostly flat except for a couple of little spots at the end. Potentially in the middle, but not too bad. Maybe we go this SU. Uh, that's only 85 clicks. We're not running the Alco. We've got enough Alcos going on. What about electric? Okay. We don't use electric much. And for probably good, we could use a crocodile though. Uh, yeah, let's go with the crocodile. Have we got this all electrified? No, okay, let's electrify our line and let's go our first electric train on the map. I did want to go something steamy and tasty, but just not getting the speed, I don't think. Right, keep that. Yes, okay, here we go. Let's fix the line. Upgrading the line now. The rest of it should be good. GDG. Right, these lines don't actually meet. They cross over at some point. Uh, oh, I've got to fix a lot of these lines. My OCD is kicking in now. 
I like to keep some without catenary just because I'd like to keep them as diesel and freight, but at the end of the day, the red and the blue is doing my head in. Okay, it's the red so aggressive. <laughs> okay, we've got that established now. Everyone's just like, just buy a damn train, ham. Right, uh, crocodile, please. Once you smile like a crocodile. Cargo, okay. What do we got in the turn in ways of... Oh, I didn't even check the speed that the wagons could do. Only 80. We just did that for no reason. I did, I did not even consider what the wagons could do. We'll be taking this box car here. Yeah, we're definitely taking this box car, which only does 80. And I know that with more speed and tractive effort with the electric train, it will be able to pull more. 150 kilonewtons of tractive effort. It only does 75 clicks anyway. Oh, okay, we're right. 196 kilo. That's 1.4. That's only a million. I'm happy to take a million maintenance here because I think this can make some half decent money. Okay, let's do it. Let's just stick to our guns. It only does 75, but we'll take it, okay? Box car. Let's go with... Let's start with 84 capacity. We can always ramp it up or reduce it. So if we're not making money or whatever, or we, we need more, we can always add more later. But let's start with, uh, what do we got? Two, four, six, seven, is it? Let's start with six. Just because uh, even numbers and such, you know. Uh, important. Unable to find path. Missing tracks. Electric. I wonder if it's this uh, This just here. Um, take this. Give me the tools. wonder if it's that bit right there. And possibly the station. Probably most definitely the stations. Okay, uh, I may as well do the whole thing. wonder if that's sorted that out now. Now set it on. Goods. Hey, we're off. Let's ride it out, guys. Hang on, guys. I've put a little cut edit in here because I realized I didn't do something. After here, we need to drop into Cleethorpes to drop off the food. Okay? All right, so here's the other thing that I did forget for us to do. I better chuck it in quickly, is we need to get food down to here as well, guys. A couple of things I missed. I was in, a, in so much of a rush, I missed things, all right? So we're going to put this in as well. Um, and by the time the train gets back, uh, we will have had this established. So food, and this is just uh, what? This is the tick. Um, uh, a freight delivery. D-L-V-R. Is that what we're doing for delivery? I think so. I can't remember. Delivery. Yep, okay. Go with that truck. Okay. Because we can't have it uh, not delivering. Uh, not delivering. Oh, look. We got some more new stuff, guys. Oh, perfect timing. Buy vehicles. Get me... Uh, get me these. Give me three of those. Set them on. Food. Tick. Ah, oh, D-E-L for delivery. Ham. By the way, okay, I'll fix that later, guys. Oh, I had to put in, yeah, okay, a couple of things I missed. I missed the stop there, which I just put you guys in, and I missed that little drop off there. But now we've got it established, so now I'll get you guys ready for the track ride along, and we'll do the outro. Here's our train here, guys. Let's get on board. Now, this will take a little bit of time to get this train established with the products. Like I said, we're going to have to ramp up the steel and really get the goods really cranking up. Um, so next time... Oh, that... Yes! Can we please? Uh, <laughs> so next time we can establish this line, you can guys can see it in full action. But uh, we might even have to get a couple of these trains going. Uh, but now that we're done, I I'm sorry, this is all we got through today. It's 
I tried to pack as much as I could in as quickly as I could. I really tried to expedite the building and, and setting up today, but it just goes like that. So if you guys want to see some live streams of us doing this, uh, this and the Lonely Pines, we want to do some decorating and stuff, uh, leave a comment down below and maybe we can organize that uh, because we just run out of time in these episodes and there's so much to do. Uh, thank you for your continued support and all your comments for those people out there that have left uh, comments, positive comments. As a creator, it's my job to uh, entertain. And if I can do that for at least one or two of you uh, and you can figure it about the world around you just for 40 minutes to an hour and enjoy this, then I'm, uh, I'm glad I can help with that. Um, and even, even if I don't, uh, please leave your comments below so I can uh, make myself a better creator, so I can help those people that don't find me enjoyable. And if I just don't find it, you don't find me enjoyable, uh, well then I can't do anything about that. <laughs> okay. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell notification for more content. Like I said, leave your comments below if you'd like to see some live streams of the Lonely Pines playthrough and this playthrough as well. I've been Van Ham. Stay safe wherever you are. Stay glued to your screen. And as, or, as always, Get out of here. This is the best, this is the best horn I've heard in the game.